hi guys i'm going to show you how prima vera is working uh, it's just an uh, introduction video okay now here i am opening prima vera it's 18th version i will show you how to install prima vera but not now i'm going to introduce you how oracle prima vera p6 is working and how this is going to benefit you in your project for example, uh, for example, I'm going to open a project that is a, a short project just to make you learn how this will benefit you. For example, I have a project that is of contractual matter. I am only concerned with contractual matter. Okay. Now you can see contractual matter. There are different uh, uh, for contractual matter. You what you do? You need cost and you need a schedule. Okay. So the now you can see the actual cost is almost for like uh, it is in rupees a pakistani currency you, currency you can change it out okay now this is the uh, these these are the activities these are and this is the work package and uh, in work package these are the activities these activities combine together and they complete this work package and these work packages and then combine together what happened once these work packages complete they just complete your project that you have to work on it now these are the work packages these are the work packages the work packages when they, the activities complete work packages complete work packages complete then the project will get complete and i'm going to show you it's a gantt chart as well it show you the complete schedule of the project and also it shows you the cost of the project that how much it going to cost your project okay i'm going to open these w work work packages now as you can see this is the Gantt chart uh, okay I'm going to wave it just no activities on bottom now you can see clearly the Gantt chart okay this is the Gantt chart the project starting date and the red colors of these activities show that they are on the critical path and the green color show that that activity have a flow free float uh, the activity is having a float means to say you can delay that activity and it wouldn't affect your project okay now so these are the critical activities they combine together the contract completion sign off here you can say the contract completion sign off these are the activities uh, for contractual matter I have just made a small project for a contractual matter to make you learn so I can help you learn Primavera Primavera will help you in different ways uh, it will help you just to get you scheduled the whole project it will also help you that what activities now you have to do and also primavera project uh, primavera it's an advanced tool where you can do where you can learn uh, how to do schedule compression how to make your project uh, ahead of the schedule there are different ways and this will tell you that if you do these things then what activities are going to be critical for you so that this will help you a lot this is a project and also I'm going to show you the WBS of this project for example now as you can see this is the WBS these are the work packages these work packages combined together then they will complete this project in Primavera uh, you can also having a lots of project means to say an enterprise that will be having a lots of project projects combined together max in a program a programs combined together make a portfolio of projects okay so now these are the things as we, you will learn as I have done also MS in project management, so I will mm, I will I will make it sure to learn you better.